As you know by now, we've changed our format on the Steel Pier Show. We've moved along with the times. In our 20th year, we're into disco. And ladies and gentlemen, if anybody deserved the title of star, it's this gentleman from South Philadelphia who now has to line up with guys like Fabian and Frankie Avalon and Eddie <laughs> Fisher. Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to meet Billboard's disco leader of the year 1975, 76, 77 with his band, with his arranging, Vince Montana Jr. How are you? Welcome to the Steel Pier. It's a pleasure to be here. Of course, uh, we brought Vince into the studios at WPVI to make this presentation, and we wanted to have uh, his orchestra of 47 pieces. Would you like to see a, a, a picture of Vince's orchestra? We couldn't get them all into the studio. <laughs> We'd had to have them on AM Philadelphia, Captain Noah, spread all over the place, but we have the leader, Vince Montana, and of course by now, I know you're all familiar with his new Atlantic album, which is called A Dance Fantasy Inspired by Close Encounters of the Third Kind. I have never heard such great sounds in all my life. Thank you very much. Now, if you don't know who Vince Montana is, he is the genius arranger, conductor for, well, I don't know where we could have been back in 1950 with uh, the Cameo Parkway stars right. and go all the way, way up to the there. present day. Way back there, yeah. We started out with, uh, well, back to 52 with Charlie Parker and uh, Clifford Brown and um, quite a few other people. But you go back. Jazz. Back you, to jazz. you go back when this used to be called a xylophone. <laughs> I remember that. In school only. <laughs> In school <laughs> only, right. Well, tell me a little something about warp factor number two. Sulu, you know, Star Trek. Yeah. That's where I got the title. Is that uh, right? Captain uh, Kirk, you know, they, that's their famous saying. Uh, warp factor two, and off they go. Twice the speed of light. So I thought maybe I'd call a tune. Well, that's very good. Well, Vince, with all the activity you have for yourself now, are you able to cut for the other stars anymore? Oh, fine, sure. I can do... I'm, 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 uh, I wear about four different hats. I'm an artist with Atlantic now, and I'm a producer, free producer. I can pr produce for anybody. And uh, songwriter, composer, arranger. That's all, huh? Vibe or heart player. You need, you need a vibe player? <laughs> oh, I see. You know, the vibe is one of my... Favorite instruments. I go back to Red Norvo and Margie Himes oh, and great. Terry Gibbs. The and I have Ciro's to put... Room. Yes, I remember you with Ciro's when you had your own group. I even remember when Four you... Four Rhythm? You used to play on the Mike Douglas show. Oh, yeah. Keep that there. But uh, all kidding aside, Vince, I think you're just sensational. And I, I was so thrilled when we were able to get you for the Steel Pier show because you are it. Well, thank you. I'm glad there's some people behind me and like my type of music. Oh, I like your gray hair, too. <laughs> Yeah. So helping to celebrate number 20 with us at Steel Pier on Atlantic, here is Vince Montana Jr. and Warp Factor Numero Dos. <laughs> 